Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I want to talk a little bit about something that's personal to me, and that's a corneal abrasion. Something I get a few times a year, so let's dive right in. First, what is a corneal abrasion? Simply put, it's when the top skin layer of my eye gets scraped off. Does it hurt? Absolutely. My eyes turn a little bit red, they get light sensitive, and so for that reason, it's very frustrating. So why do I get these corneal abrasions so often? Well, back in 2017, I had PRK surgery. PRK surgery is very similar to LASIK surgery in that it helps me see better. I was about a minus five and a half before I had my PRK surgery, and now I'm 2020 without glasses. However, one of the downsides to PRK surgery is that you do have an increased risk of a corneal abrasion. So what happens when I do get these corneal abrasions? Well, in the short term, there are two things that I do. First, I put a contact lens on my eye. This is a prescription bandage contact lens that helps protect the skin of the eye. And then I put an antibiotic eye drop over it to prevent any infection. Is there anything we can do for a long-term solution? Absolutely there is. With long-term treatment, I usually recommend using sodium eye drops. This helps strengthen the skin of the eye. And sometimes you do need surgery called PTK to help strengthen the surface of the eye. Most of the time, that's not very necessary. So for that reason, I just stick with using a contact lens and antibiotic eye drop when I do get these. So how long does it take to typically recover from the corneal abrasion? Well, it typically takes about three to four days. Right now I'm on about day three, so my eyes are a little bit red still but I know that by tomorrow morning, I'll be in great shape. Anyway, thanks for checking out the video. We'll see you next time.